In mathematical logic, a theory also called a formal theory is a set of sentences in a formal language. Usually a deductive system is understood from context. An element phi element of t display style phi in t of a theory t display style t is then called an axiom of the theory and any sentence that follows from the axioms t phi display style t v dash phi is called a theorem of the theory every axiom is also a theorem a first order theory is a set of first order sentences topic theories expressed in formal language generally When defining theories for foundational purposes, additional care must be taken and normal set theoretic language may not be appropriate. The construction of a theory begins by specifying a definite non-empty conceptual class E. Display style math call E. The elements of which are called statements. These initial statements are often called the primitive elements or elementary statements of the theory, to distinguish them from other statements which may be derived from them. A theory T display style math call T is a conceptual class consisting of certain of these elementary statements. The elementary statements which belong to T display style math call T are called the elementary theorems of T display style math call T and said to be true in this way a theory is a way of designating a subset of E display style math call E which consists entirely of true statements this general way of designating a theory stipulates that the truth of any of its elementary statements is not known without reference to T display style math call T Thus the same elementary statement may be true with respect to one theory, and not true with respect to another. This is as in ordinary language, where statements such as, He is an honest person, cannot be judged to be true or false without reference to some interpretation of who, He, is and, for that matter, what an, honest person, is under this theory. Topic. Subtheories and extensions A theory S is a subtheory of a theory T if S is a subset of T. If T is a subset of S then S is an extension or supertheory of T. Topic. Deductive theories A theory is said to be a deductive theory if T Display style math call t is an inductive class. That is, that its content is based on some formal deductive system and that some of its elementary statements are taken as axioms. In a deductive theory, any sentence which is a logical consequence of one or more of the axioms is also a sentence of that theory. Topic: Consistency and completeness. A syntactically consistent theory is a theory from which not every sentence in the underlying language can be proven with respect to some deductive system which is usually clear from context. In a deductive system such as first-order logic that satisfies the principle of explosion, this is equivalent to requiring that there is no sentence phi such that both phi and its negation can be proven from the theory. A satisfiable theory is a theory that has a model. This means there is a structure M that satisfies every sentence in the theory. Any satisfiable theory is syntactically consistent, because the structure satisfying the theory will satisfy exactly one of phi and the negation of phi, for each sentence phi. A consistent theory is sometimes defined to be a syntactically consistent theory, and sometimes defined to be a satisfiable theory. For first-order logic, the most important case, it follows from the completeness theorem that the two meanings coincide. In other logics, such as second-order logic, there are syntactically consistent theories that are not satisfiable, such as omega-inconsistent theories. 
A complete consistent theory or just a complete theory is a consistent theory T such that for every sentence phi in its language, either phi is provable from T or T. Display style cup phi is inconsistent. For theories closed under logical consequence, this means that for every sentence phi, either phi or its negation is contained in the theory. An incomplete theory is a consistent theory that is not complete. See also Omega Consistent Theory for a stronger notion of consistency. Topic. Interpretation of a theory An interpretation of a theory is the relationship between a theory and some contensive subject matter when there is a many-to-one correspondence between certain elementary statements of the theory, and certain contensive statements related to the subject matter. If every elementary statement in the theory has a contensive correspondent it is called a full interpretation, otherwise it is called a partial interpretation. Topic. Theories associated with a structure Each structure has several associated theories. The complete theory of a structure A is the set of all first-order sentences over the signature of A which are satisfied by A it is denoted by th a. More generally, the theory of K, a class of sigma structures, is the set of all first-order sigma sentences that are satisfied by all structures in K, and is denoted by th k. Clearly th a equals th a. These notions can also be defined with respect to other logics. For each sigma structure A, there are several associated theories in a larger signature sigma that extends sigma by adding one new constant symbol for each element of the domain of A. If the new constant symbols are identified with the elements of A which they represent, sigma can be taken to be sigma display style cup A. The cardinality of sigma is thus the larger of the cardinality of sigma and the cardinality of A. The diagram of A consists of all atomic or negated atomic sigma sentences that are satisfied by A and is denoted by diaga. The positive diagram of A is the set of all atomic sigma sentences which A satisfies. It is denoted by diag plus A. The elementary diagram of A is the set L diaga of all first order sigma sentences that are satisfied by A or, equivalently, the complete first order theory of the natural expansion of A to the signature sigma. Topic. First order theories A first order theory Q S display style math call Q S is a set of sentences in a first order formal language Q display style math call Q topic Derivation in a first-order theory There are many formal derivation proof systems for first-order logic. Topic. Syntactic consequence in a first-order theory A formula A is a syntactic consequence of a first-order theory Q S display style math call Q S if there is a derivation of A using only formulas in Q S display style math call Q S as non-logical axioms such a formula A is also called a theorem of Q S display style math call Q S the notation Q S a display style math call Q S V dash A indicates A as a theorem of Q S display style math call Q S topic interpretation of a first order theory An interpretation of a first-order theory provides the semantics for the formulas of the theory. An interpretation is said to satisfy a formula if the formula is true according to the interpretation. A model of a first-order theory Q S 
display style math call qs is an interpretation in which every formula of q s display style math call qs is satisfied topic first order theories with identity a first order theory q s display style math call qs is a first order theory with identity if q s display style math call qs includes the identity relation symbol equals and the reflexivity and substitution axiom schemes for this symbol topic topics related to first order theories compactness theorem consistent set deduction theorem enumeration theorem lindenbaum's lemma lowenheim skolem theorem topic examples one way to specify a theory is to define a set of axioms in a particular language the theory can be taken to include just those axioms or their logical or provable consequences as desired Theories obtained this way include ZFC and Peano arithmetic. A second way to specify a theory is to begin with a structure and then let the theory be the set of sentences that are satisfied by the structure. This is one method for producing complete theories, described below. Examples of theories of this sort include the sets of true sentences in the structures n, plus, times, 0, 1, smiley face, and r, plus, times, 0, 1, smiley face, where n is the set of natural numbers and r is the set of real numbers. The first of these, called the theory of true arithmetic, cannot be written as the set of logical consequences of any enumerable set of axioms. The theory of r plus times 0 1 smiley face was shown by Tarski to be decidable it is the theory of real closed fields topic see also axiomatic system interpretability list of first order theories <laughs>